This next guy, uh, he's a phenom. Okay, you've seen him on Comedy Central, HBO, uh, and first place of every slam dunk contest in the tri-state area. Everybody give it up for Noah Reynolds. What is up? Give it up for Daniel, what a cutie he is. Absolutely. I know you're thinking, wow, someone broke out of Denver Open Media's daycare. <laughs> nope. Just a guy chilling, having a good time, y'all. You know me. All right, let's get into it. Issues. What are the issues of the day? I'll tell you. Fake news. That's a big issue these days. I read a fake news article the other day, you guys. It said, drinking heavily while pregnant causes adverse birth effects. I was like, yeah, right. Tell that to my mom. <laughs> Anyway, uh, I, I also read another article the other day. Apparently, scientists have finally discovered horse birth control. Yeah, these horses are partying. They're going crazy. Um, and the article continued. It said, the horse birth control is really upsetting, um, you know, the horse Catholic Church and uh, the horse Pope. And they said they're going to have to have extra security at horse Planned Parent horse, you guys. <laughs> All right, well, that's a horse, you know, uh, reproductive rights joke, so it doesn't always go over great, but I'm sort of psyched about the uh, creativity of it. You guys are cool, though. Give it up for yourselves. Uh-huh. Yeah, wow. One guy's too excited. That's too much. That's too much. Do um, you guys like science? I'll do this. This is a, qu a quick one. You guys like science? Cool. What if dinosaurs had accents, right? <laughs> um... <clears throat> Hey, I'm a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Go Yankees. What kind of pizza do I like? Thin crust. Uh, <laughs> so Italian, Amer um, Italian, you know, it's sort of a, uh, I'm going to explain it because it seemed like, not, it seemed like to be, uh, sort of a hand thing, sort of a, they sort of talk to the hand, and Tyrannosaurus Rexes have sort of a hand thing also. Uh, so sort of combine those two, you guys. Uh, is anyone in here named after a parent or a dad or anything like that? Awesome, hell yeah. Um, so uh, sometimes, if you guys know that, it can cause some friction or friction in the family if one member of the family is named after a parent and the others aren't. Uh, and that's the case in my family, you know, you guys. Um, but it's a bummer because uh, I have a twin brother and he was named after my dad. But it's a double jeopardy because I was born two minutes before this jerk, you know. <laughs> so basically, what happened was I was born. My dad looked at me. He was like, uh, 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 I don't know. Call him something stupid and redheaded like Noah. And then he gives me to my mom for 20 years or something. And then, uh, you know, he sits down for two minutes, which is something crazy, like a thousand seconds, right? And then my brother comes out. He's like, oh, whoa, yeah, he'll be tall and be able to tan well and be a proficient swimmer. Let's name him Peter. <laughs> you guys know any good Peters? I'm going to finish. No, there are no good Peters, right? Peter Wilkes Booth, you know? Pete, uh, what was the last one? Pete Harvey Oswald, that guy was never good. Pete Diem, that famous North Vietnamese uh, general. Um, all right, not history buffs in here. That's cool. That's OK. <laughs> but uh, that's all right, you guys. Um, I'll end with this one because do you believe it? <laughs> We're almost over. I know you got, it, it, I've had a great time. That's what's important. And that's what's important at the end of the day is me having a good time. I'm not too concerned about what's going on out there. Um, I do live at home because I'm killing it. Uh, but, I also, but I also go to school because I value education. Um, and um, school is stressful. I think you guys should know that. So sometimes I like to, uh, smoke weed before class. And I know, you know, not everybody's into that. Okay, guy, let's get him out of here. <laughs> Security. Uh, anyway, I like to do that. You know, not too much. I just like to get in a good headspace before, you know, science and astronomy. Anyway, you don't like to smell like weed before class because people will think you're a degenerate. So sometimes before class, I'll, I'll yell at my mom and I'll put on her going out about the town perfume, you know? And I'll be like, hey, mom, is this perfume unisex? And she's like, you mean bisexual? I mean, like, no, don't back sass me, right? And then I put that stuff on, and then I go to class. 
And uh, I'll talk to the guy next to me. I'm like, yo, dog, <laughs> do I smell like weed at all? He's like, nah, you smell like an old lady who smells like weed. I'm like, that's cool, man. That's 50% of what I wanted. <laughs> all right, uh, let's bring old Daniel up back here. Thanks, you guys. Run away. No Reynolds, everybody. Stick around. We're chatting for a moment. So we need to pick the brain of the maestro. First of all, what is it like to be such a boss? <laughs> all right, next question. Uh, Don't patronize me, Daniel. Good. I, I got that in your... <laughs> but I feel you. Um, you're a Denver Comedy Dynamo. What are you... You got, well, you got some projects going on? You got some, some rooms, something to share with the people? Uh, yeah, I'm walking home uh, after this. Um, and then after that, tomorrow... Uh, I might go on the recumbent bike that we just got in the house, which I've been doing a lot. Oh, wow, look at that counter, really counting down. Um, I'll tell you my projects. I will. I'll tell you my serious projects. I got a show. I got a pilot on Comedy Central. That's come, it's a joke. Uh... <laughs> Nah, man, but I did, I had a good fourth, thank you for asking, and a great Father's Day, so. How are you doing, by the way? I'm doing great. Awesome. Let's throw his little, his lower thirds there and get him on his, yeah. uh, where can we follow you? Look. Uh, man, what is, uh, this is public, ad. why are you so amped? But I like it, give it up for. Uh... He is uh, surprised by your enthusiasm. Give it up for Noah Reynolds, everybody. Oh. 